One has Chobe region has nearly 33,000 elephants, a quarter of the country's total, which accounts for nearly half of all elephants in Africa. But while the growing population is a good sign for conservation and attracts tourists, the elephants are a nightmare for farmers like Chibeya Longwani, who says they ravage his crops. At the time when I, I started planting, it was very, very, uh, I would say it was much tight due to animals who were just coming rapidly and coming to destroy. The government was trying, but it was not much enough to, so that I can stay, sustain and even to, uh, to make life out of it. Uh, mostly elephants, they were coming time and again to uh, come and destroy it. Farmers try to drive away elephants by banging pots, burning hot peppers, or in some cases, killing them. Conservation group Elephants Without Borders rescues orphan calves but wanted to prevent the deaths. So the group built a toolkit that uses the animal senses to repel them safely. When we say senses, we mean we're targeting a different sense of the elephant, just like we have. So smell, touch, sound and taste. So it's a lot of different techniques that combined make one big toolkit to scare elephants away. The device called Elessence is solar powered to make it easier for farmers in remote areas with poor electricity. It uses an organic oil repellent, motion sensor alarms and lights and electric wires. Farmer Longwani says it has helped save his crops. Ever since I put it, the electric uh, lines, uh, the, I haven't had any damage up to now. I'm just pro producing yeah, very well. So now they don't come and disturb. Immediately they can approach, but they get shocked, then they move away. So far, close to 100 farmers in the Chobe region are using LSNs. From the feedback, most now preferred as the traditional methods are not 100% effective. Botswana has an elephant population of more than 130,000, making it likely that more farmers will adopt the new device. Mkondi Sidube for VOA News, Chobe, Botswana.